Karnataka. Stunning details have now come to the forefront after the police interrogated the four accused in the Shivamoga stabbing case where one group put up posters of Veer Savarkar in Karnataka's Shivamoga district. Prem Singh was attacked since the accused spotted him wearing a tilak. The accused chased Prem for 300 meters and even stabbed him. Meanwhile, the leader of opposition Sidharamaya has hit out at the BJP, saying that the BJP should not have put posters of Savarkar in Muslim-dominated areas. The state chief minister Basavraj Bamai has now condemned the incident and directed the police to ensure that the situation on ground remains peaceful. Beyond this, section 144 is also in place in Shivamoga. Now, we are also getting in some breaking inputs uh, on the same story. We are learning that the Karnataka police has uh, reacted to the Shivamoga incident. The ADGP, Alok Kumar, has said that the main accused has a criminal record. We have taken them in police custody and the probe is currently underway. This is what the ADGP has to say. Let's listen in to what he had to say. So four accused have been arrested. What more details police have now in this? Are they linked to any kind of an organization? What are the details that the police have and how did this incident take place? Whether there's a link also of what happened at the AA circle? So see, these four accused persons, out of two, we have seen their uh, presence in the CCTV footage that they are at the AA circle. And one person, which is the main accused, Jabiullah, he is an old MOB, modus operandi criminal, he is a HBT offender. And so far as linked with other organizations is concerned, till now, uh, like, we have not come across, but uh, we are questioning them. Uh, we are taking them to police custody, and after that only we can uh, conclusively say that whether they are on, uh, in, uh, involved in any organizational activity of PFI or SDPI or not. So we have to see. So right now uh, we have not come across. Uh, yeah, still uh, the interrogation is going on. It's always challenging and uh, like police, uh, they are uh, right now we are maintaining a close vigil and close watch on the situation and we will ensure that no untoward incident takes place. All right, for more details, let's quickly go across uh, to our correspondent Harish who's joining us on the phone line. Harish, now that uh, we've heard the ADGP stating on record that the main accused has criminal record, how is this now going to impact the ongoing investigation? Will the police now be looking for uh, SDPI or PFI links as well? Well, that's something that the police will probe now on whether these uh, accused who have been arrested have links with any organization. Uh, whether this was a conspiracy hatched by these uh, four individuals or whether the organization was involved, whether other people in this organization were involved, and how did they turn up at this uh, particular location, uh, Amir Ahmed Circle? Was it also something that was pre-planned to create controversy here? Remember, uh, Shumanga had already seen quite a bit of a tense situation mm -hmm. when Navid uh, Savakar's photo was put up at the mall, and then uh, you had groups opposing that and that uh, poster being removed. So they would see if these two incidents are linked and how did this uh, stabbing incident take place. Uh, now that they have all the four in the custody, uh, perhaps it becomes easier for them to probe them uh, and put together the whole puzzle together on how this went, uh, how, how all these four people went about the crime and also possibly look at whether there are more people who are involved, perhaps not on the ground, but at the conspiracy level. Right, uh, Arish, I'm going to request you to stay with us on the phone line because we'll also listen into some very crucial reactions that are reported. Shumagadali, Nadiro Katanebaki, Gagle, and Madikarikulu, Ali Kramon, and Tait Kundare, Ali Stali Nakuru Kuda, Sakar on the Martai Tare, Nadibar the Katanet, Nano, Yareta Madiru Kuda, Katina Kramaka, Kajasa Maritan, Yagali Hachuri Police Force Kuda, Kalside. Shanty <laughs> Yiritia Vata Vanadinda, Desh Dali, Raj Dali, 
ಒಂದು ದ್ವೇಷದ ರಾಜಕಾರಣ ಪ್ರಾರಂಭ ಮಾಡ್ಕೊಂಡಿದ್ದಾರೆ ಈಗ ನೆನ್ನೆಯ ಶಿವಮೊಗ್ಗದ ಪ್ರಕರಣ ಏನಿದೆ ಇಲ್ಲಿ ಕಾರಣಕರ್ತರು ಯಾರು ಈ ಎರಡು ರಾಷ್ಟ್ರೀಯ ಪಕ್ಷಗಳ ಕಾರಣಕರ್ತರು ಬೇರೆ ಯಾರೂ ಅಲ್ಲ ಎರಡು ರಾಷ್ಟ್ರೀಯ ಪಕ್ಷಕ್ಕೆ ಸೇರಿರ್ತಕ್ಕಂಥ ಬೆಂಬಲಿಗರ ನಡವಳಿಕೆಯಿಂದ ಇವತ್ತೊಬ್ಬ ಅಮಾಯಕನಿಗೆ ಗೇಟ್ ಮುಂದೆ ನಿಂತವನಿಗೆ ಚೂರಿ ಇರ್ತಾ ಆಗಿದೆ Let's quickly go back to Harish for more details. Harish, uh, what stands out in this entire incident is the way the entire uh, episode has been politicized. We, what is even more shocking is that Siddharamaya questioning what was the need to uh, put up Savarkar posters in a Muslim-dominated area. Absolutely. Uh, incidents like these uh, can't be justified uh, at any cost uh, with any reason. And uh, former Chief Minister Sitramaya saying that why did they put up this poster at a Muslim-dominated area uh, really makes one wonder on whether he's openly taking sides over there. And also, he's trying to say that the BJP instigated this protest. Uh, yes, as a former Chief Minister, he can question on whether the state government failed in terms of anticipating uh, this sort of trouble, especially after what happened. Uh, at the mall in Shumuga just a day before the Independence Day. But uh, kind of trying to justify the whole act is something uh, that's uh, not going down well with the uh, cross-section of the people here in Karnataka.